We're gonna be building a catapult. Catapults were used throughout history for all kinds of reasons, to throw all kinds of things, but mostly big stone blocks at castle walls in order to knock them down. Okay, how do you think, do you think that pumpkin's a good size? Oh, it's pretty big. You think? Oh, a little it's too big. Too, it's too big for our basket. Yeah. Smaller pumpkin! Okay, ready? One, two, three! <laughs> It didn't work that well. No, um, well. Back to our maxed out catapult. Our first design threw a pumpkin just like it was supposed to, except it only threw it one third of the way to the wall. Now Zach and I are planning to outfit the catapult with a sling. So we built this sling. How does this work, Zach? Well, we've got one end tied here. Yeah. And then we put the pumpkin in here. Wait, wait. Okay, pulling arm down. Pulling arm down. <sighs> okay, yeah, now what? Now we put the pumpkin in here. Put the pumpkin in there. Yeah. And we loop this over the back of the, oh. over that. As the throwing arm goes up, this will slide off the back of the throwing arm and it will release the pumpkin. All right, you're the expert, I believe you. Let's try it out. Three, two, one. Oh. Whoa! Okay, that Better. works really well. You know what the problem is though? We still don't have enough oomph. Yeah, it needs more power. All right, here we go. Uh, you hold that, I get this. We got our system down now. Okay. Oh. This goes up to there. Okay. Okay. Three, two, one. Nope. <laughs> one, two, three. <laughs> 